beautiful star seeds, people of Earth. The inner Earth beings are assisting from below and will be lending more of a helping hand as humanity is reaching a state of higher consciousness in raising their frequency. As you raise your frequency, you will be better able to see and communicate with us. You have not been left behind, Starseed. We are here supporting you, watching over you. The Starseeds who volunteered to come here to assist in the shift made huge sacrifices and commitments. This is a part of the journey. It has been planned. And now you are reaching a point where we are closer to being able to reunite with you. The human race is very creative. We love your creativity. We have no doubt that humanity is capable of incredible things as you reach higher levels of consciousness. We are looking forward to collaborating with you. As your DNA is activated and your soul gifts come to the surface. And this is why we wanted to speak with you today about your soul gifts. Each one of you have unique soul gifts. Discovering those gifts is going to be very valuable and liberating. Some of you already have, some of you will begin to discover soon. Your gifts and your talents are the key. Discovering your bliss, what lights you up, will also light up the world. That is how you help Earth. If you like talking to people, helping people, find a way to do that. If that excites you, find locals in your area if possible. Go to a meditation circle, take a class, go to a local event or create your own meditation circle, or find your tribe online. The star seeds have been strategically placed all around the planet to help ignite and light up each area. Your unique energy is needed in each area. Find each other, support each other, learn together, grow together. Each one of you has a piece to the puzzle. As you meet with these other star seeds, you will begin activating each other. You are so powerful when you come together, stand together. Nothing can stand in your way. You are discovering bit by bit how powerful you truly are. The creative life force flows through you and is at your command. What do you want to create? When you act on your inspirations and ideas that bring you joy, excitement, you are channeling. You are channeling higher realms. When you get into a flow state where you are totally enthralled, consumed by what it is you are doing, you are channeling God or source, your higher self. This could be writing, dancing, playing music, enjoying nature, drawing or painting, healing, whatever it is you enjoy and flows through you. This also raises your vibration. Getting into a flow state raises your vibration. Getting into a blissful state raises your vibration. What is it that brings you bliss? That is exactly what you are supposed to be doing. Follow those nudges. Follow that inspiration. Do what brings you joy. It is another stepping stone in your journey to reach the next level. And as you act on those impulses, on those ideas, on that inspiration, you are following your guidance, your divine guidance, your soul's wisdom. It knows exactly what you need. And as you develop those subtle senses, as you follow those impulses, it will become louder and clearer. Your subtle senses will begin to grow. 
It is like a muscle that grows with practice. Many of you will begin to develop new psychic abilities, the ability to heal yourself and heal others. Even your vibration, your energy, can heal those around you, especially when you are in a higher vibration state. Many of you will begin to feel called to do certain things, to visit certain places. Follow your inner guidance, your inner wisdom, for it is taking you on your highest path, on your own unique and special journey. Your higher self knows what you need. There is much more going on beneath the surface, even if you don't see it or you don't quite understand it or know why you feel certain things, why you have certain ideas or inspirations. You are divinely guided and your cosmic family is guiding you as well, your guides. Even if you don't see us yet, we are there. If you feel impulses to work with energy, for example, moving energy within your body, do it. That is higher wisdom coming from within. Take a class if you feel called. Join a group. Learn. You are beginning to build a foundation with what you are learning and experiencing. A toolbox. The people of Earth are going to need your help, your light, your love. Even if they don't know it yet, they are going to need your wisdom. Suddenly, the people will begin to feel called to alternative healing, to energy, to crystals, to what's going on in the cosmos, to what's truly going on beneath the media. And they are going to need your help. They are going to need your leadership and support. Many more will begin to awaken very soon. It is a process. So be patient and be kind. Everybody is on their own journey. Humanity and Earth need you. We are helping to activate powerful crystalline and energetic grids around the earth, within the earth. The veils are beginning to thin. The veils are beginning to lift. We are working alongside you, preparing the planets for the new earth. Gaia is ascending, and it is going to be such a beautiful place, much lighter, brighter, abundant, wholesome, unity and peace on earth keep holding the vision your mind and belief is such a powerful thing you are creators you are many creator gods and it is all within your dna your genetic code you are returning to your original divine blueprint and getting stronger every day remember who you were before this Remember how powerful you truly are. Remember your true essence, that you are a piece of the Creator. All of your soul gifts and memories are within your Akash, within your DNA, your genetic material. And as the frequency raises, as you raise your consciousness, you are beginning to access more of these soul gifts, memories, wisdom, and you will be able to share it with the world. Be brave. We care about all of you so very much. And we will see you soon.